Hi students, welcome to my channel Komali M. In these two complex ions, FeCN6 4 minus, FeCN6 3 minus, which complex ion is most stable? At the end of this video, you will be able to identify the stability of the complex ions. Sidwick proposed a theory known as Sidwick theory which is also known as effective atomic number rule. Effective atomic number of a metal in a complex is the number of electrons present in the metal ions plus the number of electrons donated to it by the ligands. If you find the EAN of uh, any metal present in the complex ion, if that EAN is equal to the atomic number of the nearest noble gas element, then that particular complex ion is most stable in nature. This is known as effective atomic number. Suppose, see here, COnH363+. If this complex ion EAN will be equal to the nearest noble gas elements atomic number of cobalt then this complex ion is most stable. Let us find the EAN. EAN is equals to what atomic number minus oxidation state plus 2 into number of ligands. What is the oxidation state of cobalt here? Ammonia is a neutral ligand. So, oxidation state of cobalt in this complex is CO plus 6 into NH3 which is equal to plus 3. Ammonia is a neutral ligand. So, CO plus 6 into 0 which is equal to plus 3. Then CO is equal to plus 3. Therefore, EAN is equal to atomic number of cobalt is 27 minus oxidation state is 3 plus 2 into number of ligands are 6. 27 minus 3 is 24 plus 12 that is 36. 36 is the EAN of COnH3 6 3 plus ion. 36 is the atomic number of krypton which is a noble gas element. So, its EAN is equal to the nearest noble gas atomic number. That's why COnH3 6 3 plus is most stable. Let us see the second example. First find the oxidation state of uh, ion. Fe plus 6 into cyanide ion which is equal to minus 4. Cyanide ion oxidation state is minus 1 which is equal to minus 4. Then Fe is equal to plus 2. Then EAN is equal to atomic number of ion is 26 minus oxidation state is 2 plus 2 into number of ligands here is 6. Then you get 24 plus 12 which is equal to 36. This is a EAN of this complex ion. But krypton nearest noble gas to ion its atomic number is 36. So it is most stable. It is stable. If you see our question FeCN6 4 minus and FeCN6 3 minus which is most stable. Let us find the second one, FeCN6 3 minus. Find the oxidation number, Fe plus 6 into cyanide is minus 1 which is equal to minus 3. Therefore, ion oxidation state is plus 3. Therefore, EAN is equal to 26 atomic number minus 3 plus 2 into number of ligands are 6. 23 plus 12 which is equal to 35 which is not the atomic number of the noble gas. So, FeCN6 3 minus is less stable when compared to the FeCN6 4 minus. 
third example if you solve more examples you get more clarity platinum plus 6 into each chlorine oxidation number is minus 1 which is equals to minus 2 platinum which is equal to oxidation platinum oxidation state is plus 4 after finding substitute in an atomic number of uh, platinum is 78 minus oxidation state is 4 plus 2 into number of ligands are 6 then 74 plus 12 that is 86 which is a atomic number of noble gas radon so PtCl6 2 minus is stable in nature VCO5 see this complex vanadium atomic number 23 and in metal carbonyls oxidation state of metal ion is 0 because this is a neutral ligand plus 5 into 2 10 then this is 23 plus 10 that is 33 this is not the electronic atomic number of the noble gas so this complex ion is not more stable according to the Sidwick theory MN2CO10 next example if you see MN2CO10 structure there will be one MN 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 bond means metal to metal bond atomic number of manganese is 25 minus its oxidation number in this complex ion is 0 plus 2 into number of ligands are 5 plus here one electron is shared then 1 plus 1 therefore 25 plus 2 fives are 10 plus 1 36 noble gas configuration atomic number that is atomic number of krypton so this complex is stable there are few limitations and uh, this theory is failed also yes this in by uh, by using this we can say the stability of the complex science which was given by the Sidwick. thanks for watching my video if you like this please subscribe my channel and share this video to your friends